Well, hello everyone. This is Kimberly here and I am doing something that I have not done in quite a while. Uh, vlogging out and about. Um, I have like a lot of footage that I have filmed but have not edited and to let you guys see. Um, but I'm out and about today. Uh, by myself just for a minute and I've gotten dark here and I apologize for that but um out and about today um, uh, I don't know if I announced this to YouTube to my my YouTube family but I have some exciting some more exciting news <laughs> um, and that's gonna lead to what's happening on the road today where I'm going to today um, my oldest son and his fiance has set a date and they set it for it's been set for for quite a while now um, and actually I've been doing a little shopping for it but they've set a date a wedding date and it's gonna be April 8th of next year and right now I'm on my way to pick up my other daughter uh, the son that's in college his girlfriend because she's in the wedding she's in the wedding party and they're going to try on uh, wedding uh, bridesmaids dresses and uh, Natalie's gonna try on wedding gowns which should be fun um, it's not a big wedding party we're gonna um do it diva designing on a dime <laughs> you know some things we're gonna uh, craft and make on our own some things we have bought um, that we feel that was worth buying and actually paid full price for because we wanted the look but um, still it's gonna be done under a budget we have a set budget that we're gonna going uh, that we have and we're gonna stick to so but we're excited uh, I think it's gonna be uh, Natalie and her bridesmaids her mom and myself so I'm gonna let you tag along uh, and then also with this video I'm probably gonna stick some more footage on there of things I have um, filmed this past week and uh or weekend rather um so hope you enjoy the video stay tuned for it if you want to see what's going on and um i'll talk to you at the end of this video stay tuned okay while i'm sitting here waiting for kenley to come out of her uh, house here um i stopped by my spca thrift store guys you're not gonna believe what i found um I told you, uh, well, I'll save it like that. You're not going to believe what I found. <laughs> and then I'll share, you know, when I show it to you at the end of this video, what I found. But, um, yeah, I'm glad I went in there. I was kind of hesitant because I really don't need anything. Um, I don't, I'm going to, I'm kind of monitoring what I pick up in my thrift stores because I don't want to junk up my house. But you'll see.
Well, hello everyone. This is Kimberly here and I am coming to you. I'm trying to come to you. <laughs> my husband's been cooking and he used some onions and I walked outside. Now my eyes are irritating me. But I'm coming to you because we are on our way to go check out a new store that just opened just minutes away from us. Um, it is the new Hobby Lobby. I think we're like, I'm not going to even say five minutes away. My husband's holding up two fingers. We're like two minutes away from this store. So, um, oh goodness. Uh, so we're excited. They just opened today. So we're just going to do a little walk through and check it out. Yeah, we know how Hobby Lobby is because we have another one in our area as well. But this one is way closer. So you're going to go in with us and we're going to check it out. Stay tuned. All right, guys. See, uh, they're building a new mall right here. And the first store to open is the Hobby Lobby. Turning in here, and it is packed. It was scheduled to open. I guess like, well, they're having a grand opening on Monday. They opened it officially today. There is the new Hobby Lobby.
All right, guys, it's haul time. I'm starting off with Family Dollar, where I purchased this Bless Our Home clock. It's beautiful, and I can't wait to show you guys where I placed it in our home. And it's a fairly large clock. I also picked up these hangers. I'm gonna start picking them up when I see them clearanced. I'm gonna pick these up at Marshall's. I've been hearing so many things about these hangers. I think I paid like $8 for a pack of 25. And then from Hobby Lobby, our new Hobby Lobby, we picked up a pack of this cork board here. It's a pack of four in there. And you know I didn't pay regular price. I used my 40% off on this cork board. And then I'll show you later how we use it. I also picked up these two jars here. These were half off. Uh, that Friday, right. It's so only paid $4 for both of the jars. And then these were also half off as well. I picked up two shelves and they came with the bracket attached to them. which I was loving. And these were regular price $39.99 a piece and we paid $39.99 for the bulk of them. Now I went back in there the grand opening day and of course I had to look at the planner <laughs> planner items that they had in there so I picked up this little chain there uh, these paper clips I thought these were so cute and all this stuff was half off with the exception of the gold pen I used my 40% off coupon on this beautiful gold pen there And then these were also half off the pillow covers. And um, I kind of been eyeing them for a little bit, but I was like, hey, I am going to wait till they go on sale. And I'm glad I did. They were $6.99 regular price a piece. So of course, with them being half off and picking up two, I paid $6.99 for both. And guys, these, this is what I found in my SPCA thrift store. Uh, this is sitting in Hobby Lobby right now, so I was like, oh, I was eyeing them in Hobby Lobby, and then when I walked in my thrift store, I couldn't believe it. And I think this one was marked $9. When I go in SPCA thrift store, I, I do not pay full price for it of what they want on it. I always shop when it's 50% off, so I got that one for $4.50. This one was marked 10, but it has a little chip on the front. So the, the lady, the associate gave me an additional $2 off. So I only paid $3 for this canister. And then this uh, plate here was marked 25. So I only paid $12.50 for that. So the price of one item in Hobby Lobby, I, I purchased three pieces in my SPCA thrift store. And 
my sister, Misha, with just some ideas. She was looking out for you, girl. Um, she purchased this KitchenAid for me and in her Target, I call her the Target Queen, and we ended up meeting and fellowshipping. Our families uh, met, and we had a good time that gave us the opportunity to meet, and we're going to do it again, but I want to tell Misha once again, thank you for looking out for me. You knew I wanted this uh, KitchenAid, and especially in this color. So thanks again, Misha. Just some ideas. And as I close, I'm showing you some uh, some pictures and some footage of iDrive. It's or International Drive. It's one of the uh, famous tourist sections in Orlando. But I would like to thank you for watching this vlog. If you've enjoyed this, please give me a thumbs up. And I want to take the opportunity for those who who have not subscribe to the channel. I invite you to subscribe to Diva Designing on a Dime with Kimberly Davis. I am also on other social media sites, which are Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, as well as Twitter. You can look down in my description box. The links to those media sites will be listed down there below. Again, thank you so much for watching. You take care, you be blessed, and I will see you on the next video. Bye-bye, guys.